In this tutorial, I will show you how to add an assignment. First, I'd like to share a tip that it's best to create a gradebook item for your assignment before creating the actual assignment. This allows for grading to take place in the gradebook as well as in assignments and not just limiting you to one. So, go to your assignments and to add an assignment, click Add and you'll be brought to this form. So you can give this a title, research paper, open date, your due date, and you can accept it up until whatever date. You can select the different student submissions, inline, which will just be the text box, attachments only, inline and attachments, non-electronic or a single uploaded file. Inline and attachments is pretty standard. You can allow resubmissions, you can allow unlimited, and you can accept them up until whatever time as well. For your grade scale, typically you're going to do point, but you can do other settings. And for points, you need to enter in a point value, and this one will be worth 20. Then you can add your assignment instructions, and typically you can have this written up in Word, and you'll want to use your paste from Word, paste in with using Control V, and that'll strip any weird formatting that it does in Word. Or you can just simply create your own text here, and you have plenty of different options to where you can edit this, these instructions. You have the option to add the due date to the schedule, you can add an announcement about the open date, and you can add an honor pledge which will be a checkbox for the student to select yes agreeing to the honor pledge before they submit the assignment. As far as grading goes you can either not add the assignment to the gradebook, you can add it to the gradebook, or you can associate with the existing gradebook entry, which is what my tip was about earlier. So now you can easily select your research paper and not have any issues here. You can change your access to where it's the entire site or you can display it to selected groups that you've set up, whether it be for different lectures, for different groups, anything like that. I'm only going to display it to the entire site for this though. You have a submission notification email for when your students submit this assignment. You can either get email notifications or not. And you can get them for each or you can get a summary email each day. You can add attachments. You can add a model answer a private note and all-purpose item. When you're done, click Post. And you'll see that the assignment is now listed here. 